Knuckle probably does enough to Aleki at max attack, I hope so. Nope, okay, that is like max physical defense Aleki. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome to another Pokemon Sword and Shield VGC 2021 video. Today's video, I'll be trying something pretty interesting in the showdown chat room. I'm going to just ask people for Pokemon and the first six Pokemon that they give me will be on my VGC team. But before we do that, do me a favor, check out the link in the description to the Tiltify campaign where me and a whole bunch of other streamers are raising money for mental health awareness. It's a very good cause considering all the lockdowns that are going on right now. So if you guys want to donate to that, uh, that would be greatly appreciated. At the end of the week, we'll be continuing to raise money uh, on Saturday at 5 p.m. CST by participating in this VGC tournament. So yeah, but with that out of the way, let's go ahead and get into it. Leave a like if you enjoy, subscribe to the channel, turn notifications, and let's see what we end up with. This is going to be so awkward. Hey guys. So I want to challenge myself by around the next six Pokemon you guys list that are VGC viable. Alright, so let's see if people just like drop Pokemon. So we have Tornadus T, well that's a new one, Spectrier, um, Celestela, Cresselia, uh, Heatran, <laughs> Guzzlord. Okay, so I have what I need. Everything on this team is a legendary. However, there is a Guzzlord. Okay, got what I need. Thank you. Tornado, Spectrier, Celestela, Cresselia, Heatran, and Guzzle. This is going to be interesting. I'll, I'll go ahead and close out of the chat room. But I have to team build around this, and that doesn't seem very fun. I mean, I really wanted to build around Tornadus anyways. It's really fast, but it's not faster than, like, Spectrier, you know? We have a Trick Room option, which is cool. So I'll just go ahead and make this guy Trick Room already. Zero speed. Uh, we'll just go, like, max physical defense to help me beat Glacier, I suppose. Uh, we will go Relax Nature. Trick Room. I, I really don't know what else I need. <laughs> uh, let's go with the Citrus Berry. Or maybe even a Mental Herb. Mental Herb might not be bad. I don't think a Mental Herb's bad. There's a lot of Taunt right now, I think. So, Trick Room. Mental Herb. I, I really want to use Guzzlord. Weakness Policy. Um... How do I use Guzzlord in a way that doesn't make him just completely awful? I might need to use physical Guzzlord, but that feels risky as well. I mean, special Guzzlord doesn't seem terrible. He has a higher physical attack set, though. I'll go physical. Yeah, I'll go physical. Uh, Dragon Claw. I could run Rush for more power, but I think it's the same when you Dynamax. Um, Brick Break doesn't seem bad. Literally just because there are screens running around right now. I need a dark move and go crunch. Or actually, do I want to run special just so I have more options when it comes to comboing out of crunch? Because max darkness, lower special defense. I don't know. Um, I definitely need like earthquake. That doesn't seem bad. I don't know. Heatran. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I could go tailwind on this guy, maybe. I know that I'm probably going to want to run, like, U-Turn. Hurricane. This this team is probably not going to work. This is almost like just proof that building entirely around legendaries is, is not how you make a team. You need to actually know what you're doing when it comes to, like, picking Pokemon. But if we look at this, a lot of things could blow a hole in this team. Eh, I guess it's not as bad as I think, but still. Like, we have one water resist, and it's this guy. So Tapu Fini can just come in and just start clicking Muddy Water, and then Guzzlord comes in, and he goes, oh, I'm the resist, and then he just gets Moonblasted to, you know, just right off the face of the earth. He just gets Moonblasted. Hmm. Um, I mean, I, I definitely need to run, like, a special set, I think. So we'll go Hurricane. Or can I just run Air Slash? kind of want to run Hurricane for the extra damage. But it doesn't feel right, you know? 
I could self U-turn Guzzlord and just start weakness policy attacking, you know, and then go in the go into uh, Cresselia. So maybe maybe I do that. Maybe we run like max special attack, max speed. U-turn Hurricane. I don't want to run Nasty Plot. Weather Ball could be interesting. Maybe I run like an Assault Vest on this guy, just to ensure that I don't like automatically lose to Regieleki. That could be uh, that could be something interesting. Um, Brutal Swing doesn't seem very good. And is there? Wow. I mean, this guy's really only good with like Tailwind and stuff. But I'm running Therian, so I don't want to just run Tailwind for the sake of having Tailwind. Like, does this team really need Tailwind? Not really. I guess we could just go Dark Pulse Sludge Bomb. Spectre, I mean, I, I guess I need to run like a Focus Sash. I'll just go Max Max. Like, is there any other way to run Spectre besides Focus Sash? I guess I could Life Orb him as well. I'll run the four moves he gets. <laughs> Dark Pulse, uh, Shadow Ball, what is it, Mud Shot, Protect. Is there is there any other move I could run? I guess I could do Will-O-Wisp Hex. That could be interesting. But I, I don't think that's very good, to be honest. Snarl, maybe. Just a full specially defensive set. I mean, this, this thing's so bad, man. It's so bad. Celesteela. I mean, obviously we want to run leftovers, you know? Leech Seed. Protect. Um... We could do Steel Roller. Steel Roller could be interesting. I mean, Heavy Slam is probably better. Maybe Flash Cannon. We have enough special attackers, though. I think we'll go Heavy Slam. Even though, like, it doesn't affect Dynamax Mons, I think that's fine. You know what, low. Let's do Steel Roller. For the Heat. We have, we have to go completely Heat this session. Flying. What moves do you get that are flying? I could run Actually Fly. <laughs> like, Actual Fly Celesteela. Wait a minute. Do I have anything to set this off? No, I don't. I really wanted to run, like, um... Weakness Policy Fly or Weakness Policy Acrobatic Celesteela. That could have been interesting, but I, I don't know. We could try Fly. Nah. Um... Maybe I... Maybe I could do something like that? I Nah, that, that's just bad. We'll go with the Special Attacker. Flash Cannon Air Slash. Flash Cannon, Air Slash, uh, we'll just go full Specially Defensive. Bit of Physical Defense. Special Defense, minus Attack. Yep. I mean, obviously Cresselia needs Trick Room. I could try to run some Heat here. What if I... wait. Did I see Guard Split? There's Guard Swap. Dang. I wish I had guard split, because then I could actually make Guzzlord, like, bulky, you know? So, we have Trick Room. I guess we run Psy Shock or Psychic. Let's go Psychic. Hmm. Ice Beam for Lando. And I guess Protect? It doesn't get Imprisoned, I know that. Let's just do helping. Nah, we need protect. I was gonna say helping hand, but protect just seems better. Okay. I think for Guzzlord, since everything is just a physical attacker right now. Hi guys, Future Marcos here, editing the video. Uh, what you're about to notice is what's known as a Moxie boosted brain fart. That's when I say something so absurd uh, that you can't help but comment about it. So yeah, um, you're, you're gonna see me do something really dumb when I just built a physical Guzzlord before your very eyes. Okay, carry on. We could go just max defense, max special attack, four special defense. <laughs> I don't need to max out his HP, man. Trust me, this is the way to go. Yep. I'm hoping that'll let him live something, you know? Hopefully something. Nah, not Lava Plume. We'll go, um... Heat Wave, Protect, Flash Cannon, and I guess Taunt to prevent opposing Trick Room? I know for a fact I want to run a um, 
a sugar berry. Actually, you know, I think I have a sugar berry Heatran somewhere in my VGC 2021 teams. Where are you? There you are. Okay. I'm going to steal this set because I know it works. Because I know it's it's like a solid Heatran set. Beyond that, this team looks like absolute garbage. I'm not ready to hit the ladder with this. Uh, yeah, we'll go Timid Nature. I, I think that the only way we're going to get away with winning with this thing is if we face some really, really awful players. Because I, I see so many issues with this team just synergistically. Let's switch accounts so no one knows who I am. Choose name. Uh, we'll just... I don't want to use Sabado Gigantamax. I really like that team. We'll go back to Telemundo Univision. GLHF, please go easy on me. Um, Heatran doesn't seem awful on lead here. It really doesn't. Am I zero speed on my Guzzlord? I should double check that. Zero speed. Ah, we're still max speed, dang it. Alright, zero speed. I fixed it. I fixed it, guys. We're good. I mean, they're just going to go Trick Room. And Glacier sweep me, I think. Celestial doesn't seem bad. But everything else really does. Hmm. We'll go Heatran on lead. Or maybe I just bring Heatran in the back. I could try it on lead, though. Um. I assume they're going to lead off Incineroar plus Dusclops, if not Regieleki plus Dusclops. Wow, this team's really a lucky week. We can try to go Guzzlord <laughs> and just hope for the best. You know what? No. No, we're going Guzzlord, Tornadus on lead. Heatran in the back. Celesteela because I can't think of anything else that might be useful. Okay, so I can't self-proc my weakness policy. But I can hit him with that Brick Break. And that's what matters here. Let me go ahead and Earthquake and switch in Celesteela, pretty much sacking it. You know, maybe I just U-turn and hope that he doesn't fake out the Tornadus. I hope he just goes for screens. Okay, that's fine. Reflect. Earthquake. <laughs> that does nothing to a Leky. Why, Guzzlord? Why do you have to forsake me like this? Okay. Um. I can, I can try. I can try to go Heatran here. I want to make sure I'm not getting intimidated here, you know? I knew he wouldn't attack there. We got the confusion? Hit yourself. We need it. Alright, there's the parting shot. Who's coming in? It's our boy Dusclops. Oh, Dusclops. Can you please shut up Trick Room? Please. Let me get in Guzzlord. I'm going to try to U-turn on myself. He should just knock out Tornado. <gasps> Pog? Is this a Pog moment? Oh, it's not. Okay. Well, at least we, at least we activated our weakness policy. Get that weakness policy. Let me send in something that threatens Incineroar, maybe. Yeah, I'll just go Heatran. And now, we are going to Brick Break. And also, Taunt does Cops Preventing Trick Room. Oh yeah, baby. Swag. There's the Glacier. Check it. Wow, that actually, did, that, that did a respectable amount. Does it do damage after it does that? I, I don't know how it works. I'm about to cash money on this man. Give me back my <laughs> give me back my boost, please. Please, I need this in my life. He's got citrus, okay. Get some damage. Get my uh special or get my physical attack boost. Um I have to make sure that. He never gets Trick Room off. That's how I win now. He has no switch-ins to Knuckle, so I'll just Knuckle again. As well as Heat Wave. Yep, he's just going to Parting Shot, bring me, back, bring me back down to neutral. But I think Knuckle probably does enough to a Lucky at max attack. I hope so. Nope. Okay, that is like max physical defense a Lucky. Which I suppose makes sense. Um, we're just going to Knuckle it again. Or I guess I could Quake too. He's just going to switch out, isn't he? He should just go in center or I'll just knuckle and taunt. If he Dynamax as a Lucky, we lose. <laughs> okay, there's the taunt. There's my knuckle. 
I don't think he's in range of getting KO'd, but I suppose we don't know unless we try. We'll, we'll Brick Break the Incineroar and go Heat Wave. Shout out Guzzlord. Shout out Guzzlord not dying immediately. As he goes Incineroar, bring me back down. Heat Wave. He's immune there. He should always fake out the Heatran. So I'm going to Crunch. And also Taunt in case that doesn't work out. <laughs> nope. Guzzlord will forever be mediocre. Okay, uh, I don't think Dusclop stays in unless he has Pain Split. But also, this Brick Break into Incineroar plus Heat Wave is kind of free. So we'll do that. Okay, he does have Pain Split. Brick Break, get rid of the light screen. Guzzlord is now going sicko mode. With a. Did he just get a special attack boost? Wait! No! <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, no wonder we weren't picking up KOs. <laughs> this is the worst video ever, dude. <laughs> Why am I like this? <laughs> oh my god. Um We need to keep him healthy. I'll I'll just I'll just KO Dusclops, I hope, and switch in Celesteela on the ground move. I don't think he KOs Guzzlord here. He should try to KO. No, you, you KO's Guzzlord. Brutally, in fact. Like, like no mercy whatsoever. Okay, now he's gonna KO Guzzlord. Get in my Heatran. Let me, uh... Let me Leech Seed the Glacier and just kinda hope. And then next turn, if I Protect, I can Flash Cannon him and KO. Oh god, Celesteela. Okay, good game. Good game. Well, I fixed the spread. <laughs> I fixed the spread. <laughs> this is the worst video I've ever put out. Okay, well now with our updated Guzzlord. Um I I don't know. <laughs> this is still such an awful matchup. I think what I do here is I lead off Heatran hoping to taunt their Dusclops. And also, hmm, maybe I should have gone special Guzzlord. And I think I also go Tornadus to get some damage on Finny. Guzzlord in the back, and I, I think Celesteela. Okay, so they're just gonna go for screens. I kind of want to see if I can prevent a Calm Mind, because I think that's what I would do here if I were them. So I'm going to taunt them. And also... Sludge Bomb for damage. I should be faster. 108. There's the Electroweb. We survive. Uh, I am no longer faster. I was very certain he would have gone for not that. Okay. Okay, this is not going well. This is, this is not going well. Guzzlord, you are going to win this match for me. I swear it. I swear it, Guzzlord. We're going to try to Sludge Bomb, hoping he misses the Electroweb. Light screen. Okay. Get in here, big boy. Or me? Yeah, yeah. We're just going to do it. You got this, Guzzlord. <laughs> you got this. You, he doesn't. He really doesn't, does he? He should go for a Reflect here. So I'm going to try to Flash Cannon for the KO, switch in Celesteela. Oh, what? What? Why would you switch there? Hello? Sir? All right, we're getting Guzzlord now. Um, And I want him to set up Trick Room, to be honest. Oh, no. Uh, I think what I do here is I taunt a Lecky, get in Guzzlord, let him set up Trick Room. Okay, Trick Room, please? I would like that. No, you're just Nightshaded. Okay. Um, I, I have no way of setting up Trick Room. 
Please just be dumb and set up Trick Room. That's all I need right now. Max Quack. Please. Try to Volt Switch. Did he Trick Room? Please tell me he Trick Roomed. No, he Nightshaded. Oh, no. Uh, we now live the hit, though. I kind of want to max Knuckle. Assuming he wouldn't stay in here. I could double into a Lucky, actually. Hmm. I'll just Quake. He has two Flying types, but maybe he'll just not go into that, you know? Maybe I'll just get Lucky. Okay, Tapu Fini. <gasps> I get my Beast Boost. And the biggest threat to my team is going to be dead. Don't burn me, don't burn me, don't burn me, don't burn me. Set up Trick Room, please. You know you want to set up Trick Room. Just make a bad play. That's all I need. Just make a bad play. Okay, it's Stack Attacka. This is doable. This is, this is doable. Because I, I should be slower than Stack Attack. I have 28 speed. Oh, wait, he's slower. Dang it. Even at minus one, I'm not slower than Stack Attack. No. Okay, Leech Seed. And I think I Wormwind Dusclops. Okay. This isn't terrible. He Trick Roomed up. Now I Protect and I go for the Brick Break on the Aleki. If he switches out into uh, Stack Attack, that's like best case scenario, I think. I, 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 I feel like I should know this. I feel like I should know whether or not it calculates damage before or after you Brick Break. But I don't. We've removed the screens. Guzzlord is at plus one. You got this, buddy. You got this. Leech Seed. I could also Earthquake. That would probably do more. I think it does more. Relatively certain it does more. He's just going to haze again, though, is the issue. <laughs> Steel Spike. Oh! I might be able to win this. Earthquake. Oh, okay, he was Shooka. And that did nothing, too. Oh, my God. Why are you like this, Guzzlord? Let me Leech Seed the Dusclops as well. And uh, I suppose I, I just Earthquake again. I might be able to wallet stack attack it because I'm full physical defense. But it's going to be a very close battle. I have to land this. <gasps> we get a second one off. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Now I need to protect here <laughs> an earthquake again. You got this, man. You're the best, Guzzlord. You got this. Uh, <laughs> I love how they just listed six legendaries and we have a trash team. Okay. Steel Spikes into Guzzlord. Because he does have Pain Split. But the Trick Room ends this turn. Okay, um, I need to air slash flinch, I think. I don't think flash cannon will ever do it. Oh, no, he got me in range. Yep, okay. Uh, it turns out flash cannon would have done it, so that, that sucks. Uh, but I think the, the stack attack of body press is what sealed it, the body press on it. Okay, let's do one more. Let's try to get one more. Okay. Something I'm noticing right off the bat uh, is that Guzzlord does not do anything in this matchup. It loses to you, 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 especially you, maybe you. But if the Trick Room goes off, oh, we are in business. 
we are in business. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to lead off Cresselia and Tornadus, bring Gozord in the back. I'm acting like I know what I'm doing here. I really don't. I'm going to bring Celesteel in the back. And the reason I'm leading like this is because if I land a Hurricane, I can prevent the Wicked Blow on my Cresselia, getting up my Trick Room, and then nay nay on them with the worst Ultra Beast ever. Okay, Thunderous Cresselia. He should Dynamax here. I hope he's not Focus Sash. But I know he is deep down in my heart. World Star. <gasps> we did it! We did it! Please, please live. We. <laughs> If you can't tell, I'm very excited. He was in focus, Ash. And we got the forfeit. We got the forfeit. That's enough. The man forfeited to this. Alright, we'll do one more. <laughs> we'll do one more. Because Guzzlord didn't even come out there, you know? He didn't even come out. Okay, well, I don't know what this is. This looks like Hybrid Trick Room Sun. But instead of Venusaur, they went with Executor. Um... Thank you. Alright, so I would assume here that they're just going to lead off Hitmontop. Oh no, they should just lead off Indeedee with their Trick Room Setter, if not Torkoal with that. Torkoal with the Scary Eggman. I think my play... Is there any way to one-shot Indeedee? You know what? I'll just bring Guzzlord in the lead. This is my last match regardless. This is my last match regardless. I'm, I'm tired of using this team already. Celesteela. We'll bring Spectre here, just because we've never used that. Okay. So here's the game plan. All I have to do... Well, I just lose, don't I, actually? I'm going to go for the Earthquake on his Trick Room, and switch in Celesteela. And by, by some miracle, I might be able to knock out Stack Attacka. Earthquake. He shook a berry, so he's going to eat that up. And mind you, he eats the next one up as well. That's the sad part here. But he has no way of really beating Celesteela. He could body press me is the scary part. Kind of concerned about a body press in the Guzzlord. I almost want to go Spectrier and just hope, you know. I'm going to lead to see the stack attacker. Okay, we called the body press. Get our leech seed off. He goes for the Expanding Force Spectre, it doesn't get KO'd. Um, he should go for Gyro Ball here, though. So I'll get in Heatran. And also go for a Leech Seed on the Ndidi. Okay. We're not in a bad spot. We're not in a bad spot. What I want to do here is... I want to go for a Heat Wave and Protect... My Celesteela, because I'm Flash Fire, I can eat up the hit from the Torkoal. If he goes for Eruption, I'll just do more damage back. Which I'm kind of hoping he just goes for Eruption or Heat Wave. That'd be great. Okay, he Dynamaxed. I'm, I'm about to get Earth Powered. Okay, we're dead. <laughs> we are dead. Uh, get in the Guzzy. And I'll just start clicking Max Quake. And I'll sack my Spectre here, because there's only one turn left to Trick Room. I don't have Flamethrower on my guy, so that's not good. Max Quake, thank you. Send in Celesteela. I almost want to... I mean, he's just going to give me policy, right? So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to max Wormwind the Escavalier and go for a Protect. Because what that'll do is it'll save me from getting KO'd by Escavalier, and he'll just give me my Weakness Policy. I should have just done that in the Torkoal. I'm dumb. Max Flare. Won't KO. He misses, which is just the worst. Um, I'll max Wormwind into Torkoal again. And also go for the Air Slash. And that should do it. He's not minus two attack. Come on, give me my policy. Give me my policy. Oh yeah, it's gamer time. As long as 
Oh my god, wait, I think we just win with Earthquake. Hold up, we just win with Earthquake. This is doable. This is doable. Let me go for the Earthquake here. Um, and I also have to Air Slash into a Scavalier and hope that he doesn't redirect it. If he does, it's kind of whatever, I think. I'm at plus two and a half attack. Air Slash, come on. Oh, he just barely lives. Come on, you got this, bud. He Swords Dance. That's game. Oh my god, we got the win with the Guzzlord. Oh my god. Okay, well, that was, um, that was something. That was something. Uh, Showdown, I, I don't know if I'll come back to this. I, I don't know if I'll come back to this. Uh, like, if, if anyone asks me to, like, do another Showdown Picks My Team. However, this this was an interesting one regardless. So do me a favor, leave a like in the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.